admonish. He admonished his friend not to be late for his work. Bide. He seems to be doing nothing, but really he's just biding his time. Condone. A man who cheats on his income tax and on his expense account tends to condone these practices in his friends. Designate. I designate you to act for me while I am away. Fend. Most animals let their young fend for themselves at an early age. Hardy. Only hardy plants will survive the severe cold in the Arctic area. Limber. Baseball players do exercises at the beginning of the season in order to limber themselves up. Philanthropy. You must pay in humiliation of spirit for every benefit received at the hands of philanthropy. Recollect. Can you recollect the name of the author of Ivanhoe? Smite. He was smitten with the view that he stopped and took out his camera. Testimony. According to the testimony of the medical profession, the health of the nation is improving. Part 2. Ale. He liked the bitter taste of the ale. Beer is his favorite drink. Blend. Blend the butter and the sugar before adding other ingredients of the cake. Carnivorous. The carnivorous animals are characterized especially by large, sharp canine teeth. Denizen. The common English sparrow is a denizen of America. It was first brought from Europe to America about 1850. Frenzy. She was in a frenzy of grief when she heard that her child was missing. Incapacitate. The player's injury incapacitated him for participating in the football match. Massacre. The hunters came from the east to massacre the buffalo of the plains, killing several million in a short time. Ponder. When I asked his advice, he pondered the matter and then told me not to go. Riddle. To the riddle, what walks on four legs in the morning, two legs at noon, and three legs in the evening, the answer is man. Spank. The father spanked the naughty child for his bad manners. Totter. The old man tottered across the room and sat down on the sofa. Part 3. Appease. He tried to appease the crying child by giving him candy. Catastrophe. The war was a terrible catastrophe in which many people died and many buildings were destroyed. Daunt. He felt completely daunted by the difficulties that faced him. Gape. The crowd gaped at the daring tricks performed by the tightrope walker. Duration. He will be in the hospital for the duration of the school year. Implore. We implored him to act before it was too late. Muffle. She muffled her throat in a warm scarf so as not to catch a cold. Prank. On April Fool's Day, people often play pranks on each other. Saunter. Soapy took the umbrella and sauntered off with it slowly. Trickle. There was a trickle of blood from the wound on his face. Part 4. Astound. She was astounded by the news that she had won the speech contest. Clan. 
the people living in that valley are all members of one clan. Distort. That man's speech distorted the truth. Entrust. While traveling, they entrusted their children to the care of a babysitter. Glutton. Sometimes he gets hungry and eats like a glutton. Invalid. Unless a check is signed, it is invalid. Invalid. He became an invalid as the result of ill health and lack of exercise. Overtone. His words were polite, but there was an overtone of anger in his voice. Probe. They probed his past career to judge his qualifications. Shrine. There are many sacred shrines in the Near East. Statute. The statute increased the taxes we must pay. Writhe. The wounded soldier writhed uncomfortably in pain. Part 5. Behold, watching the first man land on the moon, we beheld a sight never seen before by man. Condescend. They should change this bad habit and condescend to be pleased with the common people. Dyke. More than 5,000 years ago, the Chinese were controlling the Yellow River floods with dikes. The farmers dug a deep dike to carry water to the rice field. Flip. He flipped a coin on the counter to decide whether to go to the theater or not. Grizzly. My uncle, who had traveled to many countries in the world, told a grizzly story about people who ate human flesh. Knave. The knaves who set fire to the barn have been caught and sent to prison. Parley. The general held a parley with the enemy's leader about exchanging prisoners. Shred. There's not a shred of evidence that the missing money was stolen. Surmise. The judge surmised his guilt. There was no proof that he killed the man. Vicissitude. The future is so uncertain that we cannot know all the vicissitudes of our fortunes. Warden. The fire warden told us not to light matches near the gas station. <laughs>